kind of question we all kind of want to know. How's it feel? It feels great, but first I'd like to thank my Lord Jesus Christ. He's everything to me, and I couldn't be here without him. I'd also like to thank my family, my parents, their support out here. Couldn't do it without them. And the team, this is a team effort. It feels so great. Our senior, Jack Thorson, he's wanted this for a long time. He, he was desperate, and I'm happy that the team prevailed today and got it through. But we worked hard this year, and the practice paid off. It's always good to see that happen. But I think overall, our team fought hard, and we did what we had to do to take it. And so, uh, you know, you had day one leader, and you know that's a tough position for you because you kind of have to play a little defense. You don't get that that drive to just want to go shoot better. But you know, talk to me that mental state and how you kept your mentality to shoot an even game today again and take home the crown. Honestly, it was great. It was great experience. Cody Bruner for Skyview, he. He went birdie birdie on a par five and a par three, and I was one over at that point. So I was only up by two after like six holes. So he was starting to catch up on me. So it was great experience, but I definitely I trusted in the Lord to help me prevail today, and I trusted my dad's coaching. He's my coach, and I trusted in what he's telling me and my game. I know I know I have what it takes, but it doesn't come out every time. And but today I really you're right. I did play a lot of defense. In a way today, I tried to stay out of trouble, but I also tried to be smart in a way like yesterday. I tried to stick with my game plan. Mm -hmm. Just good. overall, how did the course treat you today? You know, maybe you didn't hit under par today, but uh, any particular challenges out there? Uh, yeah. Well, the the course they put up a great uh, position. It was in great shape and. And there were a few spots that I was very difficult positions and I managed to stay par. So that made me very happy. It was, it was definitely a grind out there today. Nothing was coming easy. So I definitely, I'm happy with my score today. I know the individual win, win means a lot to you, but if you could just elaborate a bit more about what it meant to, to claim that victory for the team and get the sweep for everybody. Oh, it's great. The team, yeah, the individual definitely I don't think is more important than the team. I think the team is more important because we, in a way, rely on each other's shoulders sometimes. And the team lifts us up. We have great coaches, Coach Clark and Coach Haas. They've definitely pushed us this year to strive and to get better. And But it's, yeah, it's a team effort. I don't think we could have done it without those guys. They're great. You guys good? Cool. Justice, right. thanks, man. You just said, how's it feel to win the state championship? Uh, it's been a few years coming. Uh, I got second place the last couple of years, which is not really what I expected the last couple of years. Like, first year as a sophomore, is super exciting to get second. Last year is kind of a bummer not to be able to come out, but I was super proud of my teammate, Laurel, for coming out on top last year, so that was fun. And this year as a senior, it's kind of a nice cherry on top of a high school season, too. Yeah, and, and uh, that was kind of my next question is how does it feel kind of back up and go back to back with Laurel, your teammate, who's been with you this entire time? It's fun. It's always so much fun. Um, I'm super proud of Ron today, too. She's not the same as me, and I think that's awesome for her to end her high school season on such a good round. I know we both feel like that, and even though it wasn't necessarily the tournament she wanted, um, I'm proud of her and all of her accomplishments this season. This season. Mm -hmm. You were in a different situation than Justice was. You were actually not in first place coming today. You climbed back through the 18 today and beat Carrie. Um, you know, tell me you know, what was going through your mindset. How were you keeping yourself level-headed to stay the course and get that win? I was mainly comparing my round a lot to yesterday. Um, yesterday, I didn't. Not a lot of my putts didn't drop. And so today, my main focus was like getting those shorter putts to go in. And even though a lot didn't, I was able to keep my numbers down. And they kept coming, and they kept coming, and finally on the back nine, I asked one of the girls, like, hey, do you, do you know what she's at? And we were really close, and so that's when we started, like, down stroke for stroke, like, hey, I have one on her, hey, she has two on me, but definitely for the majority of the round, it was going out and playing the golf that I could. That's pretty good. You guys are good. So, I guess, I mean, you guys took, like, all four spots. I mean, how does that feel to be on such like, an awesome team? It's, it's at some cost. We all put in a lot of hard work and a lot of practice time, just like outside of practice. Like It's not just the one hour a day, it's the weekends and after practice, and I think it's all very well deserved for everyone who got it.
and even the other other individuals like Carrie, like she puts in so much time, and it's just like it comes down to like the one putt. But I'm really, really proud of how she played too this weekend, and for us to come out on top is like I think it's deserved. Three girls titles in a row. What's that meant to you to be part of something so uh, so special? I don't think I really realized it. I wanted as a sophomore, and we won, and I was like, oh, cool, like, that's not something that I thought about, it was mainly, like, thinking about me, like, how can I put up my best score and stuff, but as the years have gone by, it's not an individual, it's a team sport, and so to come out, I know we had our pep talk last night, like, hey guys, like, they were pretty close yesterday, like, we need to make sure that we can come out strong tomorrow again, so, to do that is, feels good. Awesome. Awesome.